Yo, what's good? Y'all welcome to Holla Back. I'm your host, Dante. We live in Low East Side Star Music with my man, Martin. What's going on, Martin? What's good, man? We just came from chewing it down to see Bowers up the block on Clinton Street. Yes, sir. So, what's good, man? What you been up to? Tell the people who you are. Ain't nothing. Uh, Marty, Marty Mall from Low East Side, doing it crazy. Uh, Low East doing Side. Doing the art thing, the poetry thing. Uh, I teach art and poetry, so if y'all want to learn some art and poetry, you a teen, 18 and under, come down to Educational Alliance in East Broadway. East Broadway, you I heard, heard that. Educational yes, Alliance. Uh, what yes, else should we uh, be doing, man? Uh, Mixtape covers, album covers, uh, anything that has to do with publicity, advertising, marketing, uh, from graffiti to graphic art, whatever, from painting. Just say he does it all. He does everything. Every, anything everything. you need, holla at this man. That's right, man. He comes up on his own, been doing his own thing for a long time. Renaissance. Straight out the low east side. Renaissance, man. I right, usually I spit some poetry, but I'm gonna keep with the theme of the show today's hip hop, so we're gonna go with that. They said it's been a minute since they've been able to reminisce on a basketball child that's really been as versatile in the wild. So they said, wow, as he zoomed through the thick of the crowd, he dribbled it down. The whole crowd was feeling him now. Defense moved in, you know they tried to steal, but he maneuvered to prove that his moves was real. He spun around once, used his left arm as a shield. They reached and grabbed a piece of his skin, got peeled. Now wet blood laid in a place where he got scraped, but he paid it no mind because it scabbed the next day. He went back, yup, to show he wasn't afraid, and they gave him respect just after a couple games, and they couldn't understand by the way that he played, the love and the passion he put in every move that he made. He had a scholarship to go away to play ball, but it got taken away when his grades started to fall. Now he a thug on a corner slinging drugs. All the hustlers see him, give him dap, show him love. A couple years later, your boy fresh to death. All geared up, big chain up on his chest. All his dudes came to say that he was cool. All the girls came to say that he was beautiful. Coulda, woulda, shoulda, echoes off the wall in his funeral. Yeah, holla back, man. Elias. Peace. Dude, I heard you got a sneaker line coming out. Yeah, we got a sneaker line coming out. Hopefully, it'll drop this uh this summer. This summer, yeah, I heard it. What's, yes, what's, sir. what's the name of it? What's well, we can't release the name right now, but it's going to be crazy. You're definitely going to know it's me. Exclusive. You're definitely going to know it's me. It's a bright idea. You're definitely going to know it's me. So what else you got going? How long you been doing your thing for, man? Oh, man, since like 2000. I started wow. I started off, um, I went to college to be a gym teacher. But I left after two years to, to work for a clothing line. That's when I really got into the graphics. Before that, it was straight freehand architecture for three years. You know what I'm saying? So it was crazy. I was exploring different avenues. Then when I finally got to doing graphics, I just stuck with that. Did that freelance and worked my way up. Now I do it for the city. I do it for everybody. It was crazy. And from another source, I'm hearing that you into poetry. Like I heard you do your own little poetry things. Like you're trying to teach everybody. What's the story about that? Oh, that's right. Yes, sir. I do poetry shows. Uh, I performed at uh, University of Albany, uh, Spike Ball, Club Show, uh, New York Rica, Nels, a uh, bunch of places, man. Corners on the block, everywhere. Yes, it's crazy, yo. That's cool, man. All right, so break it down for me. From going from physical education in college, right, like right. how did you come up with what you want to do in life? Like, how do you find out your goal? Like, what's your love? What's your passion? Well, my love and my passion has always been art since I've been winning awards since I was dumb young, since like sixth grade. Yeah. So I've always been doing that. Went to high school, bought and design. And then I figured, what's better? What's a better job than working in the gym, getting a summer's off and working with kids, being a gym teacher? Now I got the best of both worlds because now I do art and I teach. So it worked on the end, you know what I'm saying? Different paths. So holla that's back. cool. You got my it's man Martin here. Yes, I'm sir. your host, Dante, Low East Side. Holla back. Holla back, man.